Mike Kliss joins us now live and Mike Locke certainly struggled as a Broncos backup. Now we'll see if those extra reps during practice can lead to success as a starter. Right. I mean, he was go back 2019. He finished the season with a flourish four and one. He was given the franchise quarterback mantle and then he lost it uh, last year going four and nine leading the league in interceptions last in the league in completion percentage. So they went out and got Teddy Bridgewater, had the big competition. They said it was close. I'm not sure how close it was uh, because once Teddy got the job, they never looked back. See if Drew Locke still has that uh, big game in him against the Raiders this Sunday. You know, I was surprised to hear fans just say today that it's Teddy's job no matter what Drew does. Not sure I completely buy that. I don't either. If Drew Locke lights it up, remember the Houston game a few years ago? If he lights it up and this team scores 27, 28, 30 points and outduels Derek Carr, who always plays well against the Broncos, it would be hard to put Locke back on the bench. I think the team needs a jolt. I think uh, with all due respect to Teddy Bridgewater, we all hope that he comes back healthy. But with uh, if, if Locke gives him a jolt, I think uh, they need to stick with him through the rest of the season against the Chargers and the Chiefs. Great. All right, Mike, the NFL will announce their Pro Bowlers in what, about a half hour from now. Vic Fan just sounded pretty confident that Justin Simmons will get the call. Do you agree, A, and B, will any other Broncos get in? Yeah, Simmons, first of all, a lot of players like Simmons at the safety position, fans find out about them through the big contracts they signed uh, during the offseason. And Simmons, for a while, was the highest paid safety. And he is leading the league in interceptions with five, so I think he definitely should get in there. Pat Sertan, rookies generally don't uh, generate enough fan votes uh, right off the bat, but he's got the name with his dad, so Sertan would have an outside chance. And, of course, uh, I think all of Broncos country hopes uh, Javante Williams makes it to the Pro Bowl one way or the other, even if it's uh, as an alternate and he has to get in later.